glance may appear harmless enough, but some can harbor some of the most deadly poisons to animals. In this video, we will be looking at seven deadly plants that eat animals. But before we begin, make sure you like the video and hit the subscribe icon. 1. Cobra Lily As the name implies, it does look like a cobra snake that is about to strike. The cobra lily is a rare plant native to the cold winter bogs of Northern California and Oregon. This carnivore plant is indeed diabolical. It does not only lure insects into its pitcher with its sweetened smell, but its closed pitchers have many false exits that exhaust its desperate victims once they try to escape. Strange enough, naturalists have yet to identify the natural pollinator of the cobra lily. You need to be very watchful if you find yourself near this plant. 2. Trigger Plant Genus Stylidium You can tell by its name that this plant is aggressive. Despite this, it is unclear if the trigger plant is genuinely carnivorous or just trying to protect itself from annoying insects. Some species of these plants are equipped with sticky hairs, known as trichomes, which captures small bugs that do not have anything to do with pollination. Also, the plant's leaves secrete digestive enzymes that slowly dissolve their victims. Research has not found whether trigger plants derive any nutrition from their wriggling prey or are just dispensing with unwanted visitors but be careful when you see them. 3. Roradula This deadly Roradula is a carnivorous plant that comes with a twist. This plant doesn't really digest the insects it captures with its sticky hairs. However, it leaves its work to a bug species called Pameridea roradulae. This bug has a symbiotic relationship with Roradula. This plant has twin, woody, upright, brown, and gray stems, with shaped leaves crowned at their tips. According to research, about 40 million-year-old fossils of Roradula have been seen in the Baltic region of Europe, which is a vivid sign that this plant was more widespread during the Cenozoic era. 4. Corkscrew Plant Genus Genlisia This dangerous plant doesn't really care for insects, but its major diet consists of protozoans and other microscopic animals. The plant attracts and eats these animals, using specialized leaves that develop under the soil. These underground leaves are pale, root-like, and extremely long. The plant also has more proper-looking green leaves that sprout above the ground. These leaves are used to photosynthesize light. You need to be careful if you see these plants. 5. Water Hemlock This plant is a bit related to poison hemlock, and it was the plant that famously killed Socrates. Water hemlock has been proven to be the most violent toxic plant in North America and one of the deadliest plants in the world. This plant is sometimes confused with celery or edible parsnips, but it is infused with deadly ciguatoxin, mostly in its roots. It also swiftly generates fatal symptoms in anyone who is unlucky enough to eat it. This shows how dangerous it can be to animals. Painful convulsions, nausea, abdominal cramps, and death are common symptoms. 6. Water Wheel Plant This plant is the sole extant species in Aldrovanda, the flowering plant genus. It does not have roots, it floats on the lake's surface and entices bugs with its smell traps. There are quite some similarities in their physiology and eating habits. Also, the traps of the water wheel plant can easily snap shut in as small as one hundredth of a second. You should know that the vesiculosa and the venus flytrap share at least a common ancestor. It's indeed a dangerous plant to animals and even humans. Do not trespass. 7. Mocasium Plant the Mocasian plant, popularly known as Genus Cephalotus, is our last on the list. The plant was originally discovered in southwest Australia. It does attract insects with its sweet scent. After it achieves this, it then lures them into mocasin shaped pitchers. Now the work is almost done, because this is where the unfortunate bug is slowly digested. In order to confuse the prey even further, these plants use their translucent cells, which makes insects knock themselves silly while trying to find an escape route. What makes this plant strange is that it's more closely related to flowering plants than it is to other carnivorous pitcher plants. And that's it for today on the 7 Deadly Plants That Eat Animals. And that's it for today on the 7 Deadly Plants That Eat Animals. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to this channel and give this video a like. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.